fabulous peacock who learned to share. Chapter 1, The Beautiful Peacock In a lush green forest, there lived a beautiful peacock named Jasper. Jasper was a sight to behold with his stunning feathers that sparkled in the sun. His feathers were a mix of bright blue, emerald green, and turquoise. The sight of Jasper strutting around with his feathers spread wide would leave anyone in awe. Jasper was very proud of his beauty and often spent hours admiring his feathers. He would preen himself and make sure his feathers were perfect. Jasper loved the attention he received from other animals in the forest, who were often left speechless at his magnificence. Despite his beauty, Jasper had a kind heart and was always willing to help others. He was well respected by the animals in the forest, and everyone looked up to him. However, Jasper's pride and vanity sometimes got the better of him, and he could be a little arrogant at times. Nonetheless, he was a beloved peacock in the forest, and everyone admired him for his beauty and kind heart. Chapter 2, The Self-Centered Habit Jasper loved to show off his feathers and talk about himself. He would often interrupt others during conversations to talk about his beauty and how everyone should admire him. Jasper had become a little too self-centered, and his friends started to get annoyed with him. One day, Jasper's friend Lily asked him if he would like to join her for a walk in the forest. Jasper was thrilled to be asked and accepted the invitation. During the walk, Jasper could not stop talking about his feathers and how beautiful he was. Lily became frustrated with Jasper's self-centeredness and decided to end the walk early. Jasper did not realize how his self-centeredness was affecting his relationships with his friends until Lily ended the walk abruptly. He started to reflect on his behavior and how he treated others. Jasper felt guilty and ashamed of himself and decided to change. He wanted to be a better friend and not let his vanity come in the way of his relationships. Chapter 3, Lonely Days Jasper's efforts to change were not immediately successful. His friends still found him a little self-centered and did not enjoy spending time with him as much as before. Jasper started to feel lonely and isolated. He missed the attention and admiration he used to receive from his friends. One day, Jasper saw Lily playing with a group of animals. Jasper wanted to join in, but no one seemed to notice him. Jasper felt left out and sad. He realized that his behavior had driven his friends away, and he needed to do something about it. Jasper decided to apologize to his friends for his self-centeredness and let them know he wanted to change. Jasper hoped that they would forgive him and accept him back into their group. Jasper felt remorse for his actions and was determined to make amends. Chapter 4, A Change of Heart Jasper approached his friends and apologized for his behavior. He acknowledged that he had been self-centered and that it had driven them away. Jasper promised to change and become a better friend. His friends were skeptical at first but decided to give Jasper another chance. Jasper started to listen more and talk less. He asked his friends about their lives and interests and genuinely cared about their responses. He also started to compliment his friends on their unique qualities and talents. Jasper realized that his friends had their own beauty and strengths, and he appreciated them for who they were. Jasper's efforts paid off, and his friends started to enjoy spending time with him again. They appreciated the changes he had made and were happy to have their friend back. Jasper was grateful for the second chance and promised never to let his vanity come in the way of his relationships again. Chapter 5, A Happier Peacock Jasper was a happier peacock now that he had learned to be a better friend. He no longer felt the need to constantly talk about himself and his feathers. Jasper appreciated his friends for who they were and enjoyed spending time with them. Jasper's friends also noticed a change in him and appreciated his efforts to be a better friend. They enjoyed spending time with him and appreciated his kindness and sincerity. 
Jasper had learned that true beauty came from within, and he felt more confident and content as a result. Jasper still admired his feathers and loved to preen himself, but he no longer felt the need to show off or talk about them constantly. Jasper had learned that true beauty came from being kind, compassionate, and genuine. He was grateful for the lessons he had learned and looked forward to continuing to be a better friend to those around him. The end.